Ladies, ghouls, and all of my spooky friends, I hope you are as excited for Halloween this season as I am. My name is Carrie, and today you and I will be creating this Halloween makeup look featuring colored contacts lenses. Let's travel back in time. We are going to get our colored contacts prepped, and then we're gonna get right into the makeup. Always wash your hands thoroughly anytime you're handling your lenses. Make sure to soak them in contact solution at least two hours before your first use. You can apply your lenses before doing the makeup if you would like, but I prefer to do it after I'm done. It is time to get spooky. We are going to start off with a really strong brow so it will balance out with the heavy eye makeup. You can use an eyebrow pencil or brow powder to achieve this. Next, you'll clean up under the brow with a flat brush and concealer. Use your favorite eye primer and spread that all over your eyes so that the eyeshadow will stick on there. Also, make sure you save your foundation for after our eye makeup because there will be fallout. We're beginning the eyes by packing on black eyeshadow and creating the shape that we want. There's a lot of blending involved in creating the smoky eye until you get the desired look. You can also use multiple shades of eyeshadow instead of just black. You can use a neutral color to blend the black into the skin or shades of gray. Make sure you clean up any excess eyeshadow off the skin and then apply your foundation, concealer, and powder so that we have flawless skin. Let's add a really deep red eyeshadow under the eye. It's going to make it a little bit more spooky and as if we haven't slept in days. After blending that into the skin, we are going to take a red eye pencil and put that in the water line. Since we will be applying false lashes, let's give a little wing on our makeup. Next, we're moving on to the fun part with some white eyeliner. You could also use white body paint or face paint and a thin brush if you would like to. Remember, these do not have to be perfect. Spider webs are not perfect, so just have a lot of fun with it when creating your lines. Next, we're connecting the lines together with little U-shaped lines. If you would like to draw them all on exactly the same, that is great, but you can also add some variety in them to switch it up a little and make it more interesting. I'm going in with a small brush and black eyeshadow just to define under some of the lines a little bit more. This is going to make each line pop. Next up, we're applying mascara and your favorite false eyelashes. I'm adding a little bit more shape and warmth to my face with contour and some shimmery highlight. I selected a glossy red lip for this look, and now we are ready to insert our colored contact lenses. Make sure your lens is in the correct direction and in a dome facing upward. Then using one finger, pull down your skin and insert your lens. There are many ways to apply your lenses, but I like to do this method again, taking my middle finger, pulling down the skin, and then using my index finger to insert the lens. I also like to keep a tissue or Q-tip nearby in case my eyes water a little bit. With our colored contacts in, we are ready for everything Halloween. Have a fun and safe, festive, spooky season, everyone.